Hello, it's Emmy with Studio Emmy. I'm here to show you what I made in a Friday night craft challenge. Um, it's a mini challenge that we do in the craft hole. We're an online group on Facebook for experienced crafters. We have a lot of fun and on Friday nights we do a Friday night mini challenge and the duration is three hours and our coordinator for the event is Tiffany, Mrs. Tiffany Heggs Morrow. She's here on YouTube too. She um, comes up with really great projects for the Friday nights, and we have a lot of fun chatting back and forth, but in the meantime, we all try to make something that we haven't really made, maybe haven't um, had a chance to try before, and this week it was called Everything's Coming Up Rosettes, and we made 12-inch rosettes, and we're to embellish them. I embellished mine with just some paper, and a paper flower in the middle. I sprayed it when I was through with some homemade glimmer mist so it got a little uh, shiny but not real shiny. Maybe next time I will like um, maybe embellish before I apply them and that way they'd be dry and ready to go. I might emboss them or something but I do like how it came out so um, I'm happy with it. And what I used to make it um, were this die called Frame Circle Scallop that's in the center to cover up the hole that's created when you make the rosette that's beneath that stuff. The other one is called Heart Decorative. This is an old die I've had for some time. Um, Mrs. Tiffany gave me a shout out in her video because she knows I like green. I did start out to use green with this, but I changed up to pink and blue with some green in it. You can't really see the green though. So those are the dies I use, and this is what you get when you cut them. I want to show you what you get when you use those dies. You get both a positive and a negative here. And I first cut those out and thought I'd use them, but they didn't show up at all on the paper. Big surprise. So I did use the center here. That's the only thing I used. And then instead, I cut uh, the pink and used that, and it shows you how it looks when you cut from the die. The paper collection that I used was DCWV, the country stack. The French this is a 2014 um, paper that I picked up at Joann's, I believe, and it was on sale. So that's always a good thing. But that's how I started out. I mean, I didn't really have an idea when I began the project. It kind of just took shape during the night. So if you get a chance, check us out on Facebook. We are The Craft Hole. And um, you probably see a lot of videos from us time to time. And um, with that, I guess I will sign off. Thanks for watching.